Hi, it's Ross here for the second Centen uh, Ghost Walk. We're looking for a teenage girl who was assaulted on the trail behind me. Don't know if you can see anything here. Back in 1970s, they say that her ghost still roams this trail on October 13th, the anniversary of her death. I'm a little better equipped, but still viciously understaffed. Hi, it's Ross here with the uh, Backwoods Haunted White Court. We're taking our second trip into Centen to look for a teenage girl who was assaulted on the path behind me on October 13th, sometime in the 70s. It's rumored that her spirit continues to search this path on the way home. I'm a little better equipped this time, but still understaffed. All right, let's check it out. Wind's a little blustery right now. I'm going to take a temperature reading. This is at the Y of the trail. And the temperature is minus 4 degrees. More is 4 degrees Celsius, 4.9 degrees. I've got my little earbud in. I'm going to check out the sounds here with my little sound detector, sound amplifier, and microphone. And we'll turn it on. Turning towards the trail. Nothing special heard. This is my flashlights here. I got two flashlights that go on the go. They're not orbs. This is the Y. Right here, I got some really cool sounds. Oh, fuck. It's like a moaning, moaning whistling. Especially in that direction. A little bit of wind noise. Going off the beaten trail here a little bit. Right there, I hear some more.
It's not feminine by any means. And I hope that shows up on tape. Got some wicked rustling here through the amplifier. The wind isn't really all that bad. Howling. Probably hear a plane now. I don't see it, but I hear a plane. Either shutting down for a minute. So it's Ross here, Hamoda 1010. And uh, I'm gutting out, it's about 10 to 8. I'm gonna go see if I can find someone else going with me. I got some kind of moaning or howling. So I'm impressed. All right, we'll see if I can come back tonight. Okay, I'm back. It's about a half an hour later. I had to go grab Bonnie. This is too cool for me to just have by myself. I've heard moans on the listening device. I want someone else to hear this because I don't have listening device hitched up to the recorder yet. But uh, I think I'm convinced now that it's time to get the listening device pitched up to the recorder because these moans were with Okay, I just got a call from Ross and he was pretty excited about uh, this year's uh, second annual centennial ghost walk. And he heard some things on his listening device and uh, we're just going to take our walk like we usually do every year, starting with last year. And hopefully next year people will show up and we'll see how you know, this goes with the group and what we see tonight will determine, I guess, your guys' uh, you know, interest in things. And, uh, yeah, so, cool. Because I could have brought my paintball gun, that tends to scare them off. Yeah. Actually, they'd be afraid of these lights, wouldn't they? Yeah. So you, hold your light just a little lower. Try to aim it close to where your head beam is. And that way we get... My head beam's right below me. <laughs> okay, and then let's stop and we'll turn your head beam up just a little. Yeah, that's a good... So that way you can... Turn my... Oops. Bad cameraman here. And where are we going? Do we remember? I, I know where we're going. This here is the Y. We're just approaching the Y. We are going right at the Y. So I'm just going to pan the camera to the left a little, so you can see where the, the Y is. Hopefully there's enough light to see something. Going back to the right. Right about here is where I was starting to use the listening device. Starting to make myself nervous. We can go about five more steps. Works best when there's someone to actually film. I'll be back with more supposedly haunted areas in our town. Alrighty. <laughs>